Hello, my name is Farah. My name is Catherine. My name is Nadra. My name is Basnim. I think stories are important because they give you information. They let your minds grow. They help you with a better education. They let you visit places you've never been in. We have created this video to promote International Literacy Day. The, um, this story is called The Amazing Little Horse. One beautiful sunny day, my dad put a huge carpet that I could run around and play around in. My dad told me not to go outside of the compound. In my head I was thinking, I do not want to go out into the wild to be eaten by all the wild animals. But at the same time, I was so isolated and nearly that I did want to see and take some animals home. So one day I was walking to school and saw a cute little horse just laying on the pavement. So I secretly picked it up and quickly put it in my large book bag. When school had finished, I rigorously came back home to play with it and feed it. My horse was so cute, but then I heard the door open. I did not know what to do with it, but then a fantastic and brilliant idea came into me. I decided to put my little horse underneath my, my computer table. It was my mum. She was coming to sit up the dinner table. So when she had done all of that, I went to get it from behind the computer table. But when I got there, it was not there. I was panicking because if my mom saw it, I would get into big trouble. Then I heard a bang. It was the horse. He had made a huge mess. I did not, know, did not know what to do with it. The mess that he had made was enormous. I was so lucky that my mom did not hear the loud bang. A day later, I knew what to do with my horse. I decided to let him go. He was too messy and I could not cope with him. I let my horse go back into the wild. Lucky for him, I saw him with his mom and dad, so I was really happy. He even got more food than he did when he was living with me. So the horse went back to live with his family. The end. For more Thank you for listening to us read this for story. <laughs> for more information, please visit internationalliteracy.org.